Welcome back to Let's Play Alien Isolation. I'm Burning Dog Face. And uh, I wasted a lot of time in the previous episode. Just wanted to get going with this one. Alright. I'm at this top corridor up here. Oh, I just realized. These aren't like cabinets with goodies in them. These are just vents with the, the, the ends blocked off. I don't want that. Oh well. Um, right, I'm up here. So let me just see. Uh, change room. Okay, deactivate air purification. Okay, yes. When you deactivate air purification, it makes everything all foggy. Oh my god. Can you even imagine? Having to navigate like that. Let's put that back and then get going. There's a second after you hit B before you uh, go back into the. Uh, into the world. Okay. Free achievement. Every bullet counts. Use the revolver. Achievement. Uh, what's this? She's in the vents. Use the vent system 20 times. Fuck you. I swear a lot of these loading screen tips are designed to unnerve you. For example, hiding is only ever a temporary solution. That's not what I meant to do. these emergency showers? Oh. I had been wondering what that was.
What was the point of any of that? Maybe I can craft silencers for the pistol. That'd be nice. Take out some synthetics. Maybe since I feel relatively safe. Our synthetics are built, not created. Seeks in together tomorrow, or tomorrow together. Each working Joe synthetic at Seeks in is subjected to thousands of safety checks before being brought online. That's because we understand that we're building machines, not people. I just realized I hadn't actually started my timer. Just a moment. It's all right. We good. Timer going now. Oh. I was actually getting a reading there for some or somewhere. That's not. Okay. I like that, you know, the idea of a company specifically making robots that look like robots, but do they have to look so freaky? You're gonna have had just a totally... I mean... It's got like a dead expression on it and wrinkled skin like a corpse. They're gonna just have a generic, bland, flat expression. Oh, um, hey. Yeah, the eyes really don't help. Never mind, there's enough of it. Oh, I apologize. Let me in. I need to contact my ship. I don't. Apparently. There's gotta be another way inside. Wait, how does it know my name? Oh. Oh, it's a magpie. They are known for uh, stealing shiny objects and putting them in their nests. No materials to be removed from site. Misappropriation or unauthorized removal of company resources will result. Will result. Oh, they forgot the space between in and immediate. Will result in immediate termination of your trade contract. Fuck you. Let me pass. It's me, Hughes. Don't you recognize me? Listen to me. We've got to reestablish long range communications. You're becoming hysterical. Get back. I'm warning you. Tut, tut. This is all this amicably.
Hmm, that was probably the most important scene in this episode. But it would make a lousy thumbnail because of the bars directly in front of my face. That's what the eye would focus on in this small thumbnail image. Vibrating. Oh, fuck me. Oh, I know. Huh. Uh, your logged message. Apollo data search. Sensitive corporate information has been aut automatically detected in a Sevastolink message recently sent from this terminal. This event has been logged by Apollo on behalf of Siegson. If you have any further questions, please talk to your line manager or your nearest synthetic Siegson representative. November 25th, 2137. Apollo's Eye. Ransom. Riggs, are you still working down in Siegson Communications? Remember that trouble you got into last year? The trouble I helped you out of? Well, it's time to repay the favor. One of my colleagues has been looking into some of the import documents and found a few problems. He's new, so doesn't understand how we do things on Sevastopol, and he's threatening to go to Waits about it. This could hurt us all, so we need you to keep an eye on him. See if anything interesting comes up. Apollo has cameras everywhere. It just needs someone to tell it where to point to. His name is Daniel Halden. Lives in Josiah Sig, exec Executive Apartments, 651. If this goes well, I might have some more work for you. We could clean up here. Ransom. Uh, June 14th, 2135. Oh! What's this crazy quiet? Please understand this is our best shot. Someone has got to reestablish communications. We need to make sure the officials back at home know what's going on here. Don't worry about. I wonder if I set my headphones wrong to, or something. I'm not gonna make it um. So that guy just died. Which means, in all likelihood, it is currently December twenty-one thirty-seven. I mean, he might have said that yesterday. I could see it taking a long time to safely make your way across this station. good when it's behind me. We can only turn this far. Is that a hackboard on the wall?
Oh, wait. They have eyes, right? I kind of feel like we're backtracking, to be honest. Going back to that save point. doesn't work so well in the vents. In Alien, they had someone outside monitoring the... the, uh... the motion tracker when Captain Dallas went into the vents. I don't know what that means, but I hate it. Is that guy hostile now? Is that what that is? Don't mind me, I'm just minding my own business. It would be kind of neat if they, uh, didn't just arbitrarily become, uh, evil. If they, you know... Only became hostile when they saw you in uh, a restricted area. Wait, what's the timer look like? Not great. I would have to make my way all the way to a new save point. I don't know what to do in this circumstance. Damn it. Brave, I could sneak in there and try and look into some computers and items, but I think for the moment I'll just keep going. Come on. I 
expecting something horrible to be on the elevator. Now I'm definitely in a restricted area, which sucks. I do like there's a dedicated button for that. Central Communications Hub seeks in employees only. Well, there goes my plan. I had this idea that, you know, at this point you could find an airlock, put on a suit, go outside, and uh, if you can't see the ship, crawl around the circumference of the station until you see it, and then wave them down. Fuck. But my worst case scenario backup plan doesn't work now. Wasn't that convenient? Wait for it. <laughs> Third time in a row. Well, I'm burning dog face. And I'll see you in the next episode of Let's Play Alien Isolation. When we make our way through uh, communications and try to get in touch with the Torrens. Wish me luck, burning dog fans. I'm pretty sure I'm going to need it. Later!